Hello, everybody. This is your boy Jobs, and he has returned for Rust Quest, aka Vault of Souls. Hopefully, Rust will be able to stick around for this quest. Because he apparently insisted several times during the beta testing phase to not look. Don't look! He died! Don't look! That kind of thing, you know? It was like, I mean, it, it was like being told by your typical student of a heroine, don't look me, I mean, don't look at me changing my clothes or I'll beat you up, baka! That kind of thing. So, we're gonna find out what's in store! <laughs> <laughs> Let's do this! Ooh. This is a sock. I have to I have six heart hearts. Ah, let's do this. All this way. <laughs> oh boss. All this way, only to find a hole. Typical. Elliot! 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 I swear if you don't put down that damn book and get in here this instant! <laughs> what? Did you find it? No, but we're close. I need... You need me to crawl through some hole to see what's going on in the other side because heaven forbid you should have to, to stoop so low as to actually do something? You are thin lice already, Elliot! Don't you dare start sassing off to me or, or what? Just get in the hole! Whatever you say, Dad! Child! Um, hello? Child, come quickly. The glove! Pick up the glove! Excellent, Elliot! Okay, what's going on? Who are you and how do you know my name? Elliot! What is taking you so long? What's back there? There is no time to explain! We must leave at once! Elliot! Quick! Through here! <laughs> okay, will you please tell me what the hell is going on? Who are you? Why can't I hear you? Why am I wearing this old glove and how did we get outside? This glove is a defense weapon, Elliot! Wait, one more thing. How do you know my name? Patience! Let me explain. This glove is a defense weapon. I am speaking to you from inside the glove. The glove allows me to see the thoughts of whoever touches it. That is how I knew your name. So you tricked me into picking you up so you could read my mind. Great. <laughs> this is no time for that attitude. There is much at stake. That man in there is a threat to this entire world. Hey, that man happens to be my dad. And yet I can't tell you that you don't think very highly of him. He's not exactly the world's best dad. But that doesn't mean you can start accusing him. Listen to me, Elliot! Your father is an archaeologist, and I can see that you enjoy reading. You surely heard of the Vault of Souls. Oh no, stop right there. You're not going to tell me that the, that, that, was, the, that, that was the vault, oh, aren't you? It was the edgy chamber to the vault, yes. Tell me, Elliot, do you know what's inside the vault? No. Then I'll keep it simple for you. If the vault is open, then it will be the bed they will be the end of the world as we know it. You think my dad is trying to open it? I know he is. So think so listen carefully. You must stop him. The key, the vault key, it was split Oh, let me guess. It was split into pieces to protect it. And I have to track them down before Dad opens the vault. Well, yes, how? Have I, Have you ever read a fantasy book? This is one of the most cliche plot lines there is. You couldn't be more predictable if you tried. Elliot, this is no book! 
You need to start taking us seriously. All right, all right. Where are these key shards? There's one in the forest, mountains, and desert. You must seek them out and look for the and lock the boat before it is too late. You said the glove was a defense weapon. What does it do? I was getting to that. This is more important, so listen carefully. The glove, in its current state, allows you to fire energy shots. Press A to fire a simple shot. Or hold B to move the arrow or you can move the arrow to, to claim or aim a large shot, which will fire when you release B. The glove can also fire other attacks if you find other attack power for, for it. These attacks all drain the glove power, although it will rebuild over time. The glove can also protect you from enemy attacks. Although its capacity to do so is limited, you can upgrade its capacity by fighting health upgrades. Finally, the glove gives you get, use of power gems as an energy source. Collects these to upgrade the glove and give it new abilities. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should show you how to do that. This is the soap swing. You can access it by pressing start. Use left and right to scroll to the tabs. This is the status tab. It shows all of the items you collected. And the boxes at the number at the bottom it shows the number of health of, of the power grades you collected but haven't yet activated. <coughs> This is the upgrade tab. Here you can use power gems to upgrade the glove. If you find a hill for power upgrade, you can use the 50 power gems to activate it and add another unit to your health or power mirror. You can also upgrade your defensive weapons here. Take note of the number at the right down that this is the required global potential level needed to put purchase the upgrade. Your global potential level or GPL increases each time when you find a key shard. This is the this is the abilities tab. This lets you buy special ability for your glove. When you have an ability selected, you can hold B to see a description of what it does. This is the map tab. While not very useful outside, inside a level, it will show you if you if you collected the map compass of big key. It will also display a map in a large frame. You can press up and down to switch the floors. Finally, this is the save tab. You can save your game from here. Please note that using F6 will not work for saving or continuing. Alright, everything that you need to know is for, need for, that is everything you need to know for now. Get moving, Elliot. Okay. Da, 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 da. Excuse me, in. <laughs> okay, 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 stop, stop, I need to stop. <laughs> Actually, now that I think about it, this is the very first time that Russ has used the 8-way movement in one of his quests. I'm 
I'm gonna try to grind for levels here, you know? Maybe, uh... Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Hopping... Ah! Mm. Oh, I see a heart container over there. Let's do the desert level first, then. I know I don't really need to kill them, but they have a hell of a lot of money! And I kinda want that money! Ah, fine, fine, I'll oh, avoid them for now. Did they just take my money? Okay. Oh shit. that way. Well, at least not yet. I'm under the impression that I need to go here. I mean, that I need a key. Wow, did I just really just fall into that?
<laughs> there we go. I think it's this way. Oh. Ooh. Ah! For the love of oh! Evan decided to go ahead and hug every freaking tree. I mean, every freaking cactus. But you said there's a nice reward! I like rewards! <laughs> yeah, but watch me do it. So close. There was, I was close. If I could beat Christopher Dolan, I could do something as minimal as this. <laughs> there we go. We ain't done, eh? Hey. I'd rather forget the money, though. Ah, no, no.
Yeah! Who said I couldn't do it? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wait, I gotta activate it? Oh, whatever. <laughs> That's kind of a weird sense of a weird way of doing things. I guess I gotta conserve my heart containers, yes? I wasn't even aware that it wasn't over yet! Okay, way to be derp. Oh god, I can't even read that. Ah! Oh, uh, what? 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 <laughs> Is that the key I need? Another special kind of lock block. Nice! What are you accustomed to me just falling off screen? Cause I think it's just dead. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have fun.
I'm not seriously trying to drown a quicksand, am I? Alright, got a compass. I'm gonna be on the first floor. Yeah, it's probably more useful when I get the map. Still gonna have to figure this out. Let's try not to let ourselves get bubbled to death. Hmm. No! <laughs> I guess I'm gonna need uh, something to burn that with. Probably some sort of firepower. Oh wait, 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 there's a bridge over here. I can cross it. <clears throat> Getting beat to death by bubbles is not a good look on my record.
They might as well be taking a gun and just shooting them in the head. The forehead, the forehead shot. Boom. Okay, no sword to grab things with. Hopefully there'll be a boomerang later on or something that I can actually get things to get my money eastwards. Damn it. Hang on a sec, what's that? Whoa! That's a cool secret! I just gotta not stand still. He's right about that. It seems moving around gives me the best chance to uh, dodge all of the freaking bubbles. They home in on where I, wherever I stand, so moving is the best. I just have to survive. This is, uh, that's gonna be tougher than I thought. But I think the only way I'm gonna proceed now that I've unlocked that door is to... ...kill them. Yeah. Killed one. Damn. Yeah, I think I'll, I think this is the all enemies respawn rule. Maybe. Make no. I don't think so. Maybe I could just whittle down the numbers one at a time. If I could do that, then I might be in a clearing. All right. The glove has been upgraded to shoot water. Press A to shoot a water bubble, or hold down B to release a cloud of ice that will freeze water at enemies. Use the other one to scroll your attacks. Make it out to be hard, I was just being stupid.
Oh yeah, the wrong way. Uh, I still need to kind of go down. What am I doing? The one I died on. What? There's definitely something here. What am I doing? Uh, I gotta kinda... Okay, I just need to kinda flex my muscles, get used to this, then I'll die less. I'll die less! Watch me. Let's look, let's look, let's look, let's look, let's look, let's look, get our help back, get our help back, ah! We ain't died today. Woo! Hello!
I can tell that the quote that I mean, was somewhat inspired by Zelda Walk, perhaps. But alas, the magic she cares are different. Well, at least I got that open. Oh. Uh, four on my. I need to lower those rocks. Okay, okay, okay. It's gonna be kind of hard to decide between trying to actively stun them and outright attacking. Okay, okay. Truly skilled players will be able to stun and attack. So, I'll try my best to do both. There we go. <laughs> you know, that original death animation reminds me, I mean, makes me think about Charles Barkley whenever I get killed in that game. Like, uh, I get killed and next thing you know, a, a picture of Barkley with a sweat drop comes down on his face. Okay, not to say that Link is having a sweat drop on his face when he get killed or whatever, but... It sort of reminds me of that, when it's just sort of a silent death like that. Oh my god, really?! Why did they come back? <laughs> I 
I get stuck in that twi tiny little spot? That was a guaranteed death. Got me a bus key. And now. Okay, I see what I I saw what I was supposed to gotta do there. I saw what I should do there. I think I can do I think I got this. You got a health upgrade. Activate it for the subscreen to increase your health. You got a hundred power gems. What a find! You got a key shard. Find all three and conceal the ball seals. Your global potential level has increased. Now you can buy more upgrades and abilities. Okay, now that we got the now that we've actually got one of the shards, I want answers. What's the Vault of Souls? And why is my dad trying to open it? Paul will be on anything possible to be given to whomever opened the Vault of Souls. That is, that is the lie they spread. They? The things inside. The Vault of Souls is a prison. A prison like no other. There were people long ago. People who would do unthinkable things. They would form packs with spirits and demons and use their newfound abilities to wreak havoc. We could do nothing, even killing them was useless. They could, we discovered too late. Cheat death, climb from the graves, the vault of souls constructed to contain them. It is inescapable prison, one not even the dead could flee from. But they, uh, but they obviously were smarter than you. That's where this lie came from. They tricked somebody into thinking they'll receive infinite power and use them to open the vault. Precisely, that is why your father is trying to open the vault, and that is why we must stop him. Dad, why do you have to be so stupid? Yeah, you do realize how lucky I tend to get sometimes, right? Right? <laughs>
Okay, okay, okay. Ah! Okay. Oh, this will be useful. All right. Another hook container, another day done. Hmm. Okay. This way, didn't I?
I guess this is also the tech secret that I've already collected. Huh. I do like how useful that is. That's very useful. Okay, okay, okay. Let me block weapons. So, hey, Russ, let me ask you a question. More like, let me get this straight. You say that the enemies are now stronger now that I've actually cleared a level. You mean, I mean, it's as if you said that I leveled up. And monsters actually level up as I do. Is that what you're telling me? Stop stealing my lights! <laughs> hmm. Sounds like sounds like how Final Fantasy VIII operates. <laughs> <laughs> 